In this video, I'm going to talk about my brake master cylinder. Right now, I have the master cylinder off a 9495 Mustang. It's the same master cylinder for both V6 and GTs. It has the plastic reservoir, which I like because you can see the fluid level. Now, I didn't always have this master cylinder, um, but in the mid 90s, I upgraded to front Granada brakes, disc brakes. You can see the caliper here, it's actually facing the rear of the car. This is the driver's front tire. If you had the original 6566 brake setup, you'd actually see the caliper on the front side of the rotor here. And when I did that Granada brake upgrade, I went to this master cylinder. This is from an 87 to 93 Fox body Mustang. Again, plastic reservoir, aluminum body, and it has ports, it actually has three ports. Um, all of these ports are metric threads and bubble flares. The front port is slightly larger than the rear two ports, and that leads to your rear brakes. And you've got this third port on the bottom, which is pretty unique to these Mustang master cylinders. I think this was the only master cylinder for any Mustang that had three ports. Now this has a 21 millimeter bore. It's about seven-eighths of an inch. And that worked good in my application with Ford Granada disc brakes on the front and stock Ford 8-inch drum brakes in the rear. Those Fox Body Mustangs had front discs, rear drums, so this master cylinder worked well, and it bolted right in. Now I upgraded my rear brakes not long ago to these discs. I went to a Ford 9-inch axle, and these rear disc brakes came um, it's an aftermarket kit from Speedway Motors where I got the axle. When I put these in, that 87 to 93 master cylinder just wasn't pushing enough fluid to these rear brakes, so I needed to upgrade. So here's the 94 to 95 Mustang master cylinder, which has a 1 and 1 8 inch bore, which is about 64% larger than the Fox Body Mustang, so it's going to push a lot more fluid. Um, those 94 to 95 Mustangs had four wheel disc brakes. So this should work better for my application, and it does. Now it only has two ports on the side, like many of the other master cylinders for Mustangs. You can get a kit from Late Model Restoration to swap from an 87 to 93 master cylinder to a 94 to 95 master cylinder. Um, it comes with this line here, which goes right into the master cylinder, and this T fitting. So the line comes out and around into this T fitting, and the line that would normally come out of the side of your 87 to 93 now comes out of the side of this T-fitting. It's going to go underneath the master cylinder and over to your proportioning valve. The line that goes out the bottom will go out of the bottom of your 87 to 93 master cylinder and over to your passenger front disc caliper. Now the front port um, again wraps underneath the master cylinder and over to the proportioning valve. Here's a better look at that. Now this is the proportioning valve out of the 87 to 93 mas Mustang. It matches that master cylinder. Um, so it has two lines coming in. Now this proportioning valve was made for those Fox Body Mustangs with rear drums front discs. So if you're swapping to four wheel disc you can get another kit from Late Model Restoration where you take this plug out of the front and you replace the valving inside of that proportioning valve uh, so you get equal braking front and rear and you can run four-wheel disc brakes. Now this swap worked really well for me with my four-wheel disc brakes. The braking is very even and the pedal pressure is very good. I'll leave links to the swap kits that come from Late Model Restoration in the video description. So if you want to do this swap, all you need is that kit and a new master cylinder from a 94 to 95 Mustang. 